Oh, there's a good hit. There we go, finally. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Good morning guys and welcome back to my channel whoa today today is well this day after opening day of bass season i'm down here at lighthouse cove in the canals i did bring my kayak but i'm having trouble finding a place to put it in and leave my truck so what i'm going to do is i'm going to give it a shot from shore and see what happens i'm going to switch over to my chest mount camera As you can see, I'm using a black frog. I got 50 pound braid. And the moss on top here is more like, like a mat as opposed to weeds. I do got a spinnerbait tied on my other rod, but spinnerbait's not gonna go through here. We also got pike in here too, so you never know what you're gonna get. A lot of times when your frog clears one of those weed patches, or grass mats, whatever you wanna call them, is when they'll hit it. Move down where there's a little less grass. I'm trying to throw a spinnerbait. I know that's not what it's meant for, but I didn't bring any other trailers, so. There's a hit. There we go. Finally. That folks will be a catfish. Not what we're after. My mistake, that's a dogfish. We don't like dogfish at all. Oh, there's a good hit. There we go, finally. Oh, that's a nice bass. That's a nice bass. Come on. Come on. 
There we go. Come on. Oh, that's a really nice bass. Come on. Wow. Wow. Oh my God. This boy has been eating good. Look at this. That's a beauty. He's got to be pushing three and a half, four pounds. Thank you very much. Whew. As soon as my spinner bait cleared the back half of that log over there, he just killed it. See the big old gut on that thing? He's been eating well. All right guys, look at my crappy set up here. The fish was biting underneath this dock. There he is, there he is. That didn't take long. Just a little guy, but I'm not skunked. That's a good looking fish, eh? He was hiding right underneath that dock. He did hit my frog. Clearly he didn't want to commit to it. This is just a quarter ounce jig on a six pound test line. I don't know if you all saw that, but I just saw a snake. He wasn't that big, but there we go. There we go. Number two. Well, there you have it. That's my bass opener. How did your bass opener turn out? That didn't quite sound right, but we're going to go with it anyways. Leave me a comment down below as to how you're fishing. And I want to thank you all for joining my channel. I've got a few new subscribers and welcome. Those of you that have been with me from the start, thank you. I'll see you all in the next one. Get up and enjoy the outdoors. Later. Later.